This is some work that they're doing in combination with us and Microsoft to take advantage of DirectX 11, which is the next API for graphics. It's the one that's been out for a while, but it's the, the latest, greatest API for graphics. And so what they're doing here, they're doing three different things. The first one here is they're doing things that help approximate what a movie camera would do. So a lot of the experience you get has to do with what you're used to seeing in the movies, and lens flare and things like that are important motion blur. This next uh, demo is about the detail of, of the world. One of the big problems with computer graphics is rendering all of the minor detail of the world. And so, in this case, we're showing one of the cool new features called tessellation. If you look at the bricks, when, when uh, that was going on, you'll notice that the bricks look a lot more real when you get closer. And that's a new, new feature in DirectX 11. And finally, water. Water is one of the hardest things to render correctly, particularly water that's moving and interacting. And so you can see there that that water looks really, really good, and it's, it's going to be in their upcoming release uh, very soon, actually, very, very soon, as a patch for Crisis 2, which is already in market. So these things here, we work with developers to try to take advantage of more of this, but as cool as this looks, it still isn't good enough. It doesn't fool you into thinking it's real life. Lighting is so hard, and the detail of the world is so hard, there's lots more to do.